Hey everybody, I just wanted to go over this real quick. Apparently, um, Live 4 GoPro app on Android is up and working now. Their original version wasn't working too good, so I'm the, um, I had it installed, uninstalled it, so that way I could do this video and go through the motions. So, obviously, we're going to go to the Play Store, and we'll go up here, and we'll do the... Alright, come on camera. Live for GoPro. And of course we're gonna click it. And we're gonna Oh, I guess I just need to re-enable it. You will actually install it. So we're gonna open her up here. Now me personally I'm using the little GoPro Hero 4 session. Okay, so we're gonna the app is still a little glitchy, but at least now it's actually working. We'll give it a second, and I, I can't get focus in. The camera's not going to focus in. Let me see if I turn the light down a little bit. Will that help? Oh, that helped a little bit. Okay, so anyway, um, when you first download the app, it's going to go through and ask you to um, log into your, you know, Facebook, to set up Facebook. You know, just enter in, you know, your Facebook info to log into Facebook. Um, it does have a couple of tabs that says um, Life or GoPro will receive your email and your um, Facebook, um, Facebook status, I think it is. You can actually disable those and the app still worked, which is good. Um, I don't know what they needed with my email address or my Facebook info, but I'm not that crazy because I don't really don't that much personal info on Facebook. So anyway, so we just hit record. You see it's going live. I was downloading the video to upload it to Facebook, hopefully. And boom. We're live. Make sure we live. Here's our ticker for if anybody's going to be watching. So we'll leave it here. I don't have that many friends on my friends list. I know, sad. But um, we'll see what happens here. See how long it takes for what few friends I do have for one of them to maybe click on and watch. So that way we can prove that it is live. I know, this is going to be the hard part, right? So I got to sit here and act like I'm entertaining you guys waiting for one of my friends somebody anybody to go hey Robert's live I don't think they're gonna do it how long shall I let it go anyway I tested earlier and um, I actually had two viewers I said I wanted to set this up you know for numerous reasons my personal um, usage is going to be for doing um, live dash cam because I do drive the truck and, you know, thought it'd be kind of interesting to do live dash cams. You know, obviously your usage might be doing selfies and, you know, other, you know, other Facebook updates and stuff. And no, I do not know its compatibility or anything with, um, with doing YouTube, but I will, um, see if I can, yep, I'll cut the windshield wipers on so you guys can see that it's, there seems to be... A little bit of a delay there they go appears to be a probably about a probably about a five or six second delay something like that which is not too bad look at this two minutes and none of my friends I have no friends look at that it's not sad two minutes being live nobody's watching me anyway all right guys so live for GoPro is working and this is how you can do Facebook Live with your GoPro. So it's a good deal. Congratulations, Live for GoPro getting it working. Good job because I tried everything. I tried your old app. I tried VLC. There was just no way to use cellular data on a phone to get GoPro Live. So now there is. And congratulations to them. 
and I'll post a link to download the app. Ah, there's another, there's a truck driving by. So we had some action. We still have no viewers, but it is live, guys. It is, it's doing its job. So, all right. I hope you found this information useful. If you did, hit the like button. Look at that big old thumb. Like, 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 like. If you hated it, eh, don't do nothing. Just go away if you hated it. All right, guys. Hope you enjoyed this one. We'll see you in the next one.